What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the Swill Entertainment channel. All right. So we got a brand new one for you guys. It's called Axe. Now, this game is not released yet, so don't be like, oh, give me the download link. If I can get the link for you guys, I will totally do it. All right, so we have two different factions right now, guys. We have the Yan and the Falcon. All right, the giant infernal dragon appears before those investigating the relics of the divine continent. I don't know which one I should pick, the Yan or the Falcon. So try using the hero NPC in battle. If you skip the experience, the download will begin immediately. All right, so I guess we're gonna try the Yan. They look pretty cool so far, I don't know. Doesn't give you like a description or anything like that. If it's wrong, we'll make another account. Not a big deal, right? All right, try using the hero NPC in battle. All right, so it looks like what we need to do is just click some of this stuff right. Whoa, what is that? All right, let's get this going, guys. Look at that. It doesn't even give you like a chance. It put you in the game off the bat. I thought she was like a, a range class. Oh, we do something. What? This is kind of cool, man. It's got that lineage revolution type of feel. Alright, so am I dying or what? This is kind of hard. That's what she said. Jump. Woo! Look at that dragon. And that dragon is beat, guys. Done and done. Python, creator of chaos. Long ago, his two gods and their children waged a war that would shape the world. Under the blessing of the Lord, the elves, humans, and dwarves fought bravely against Kaiden and his legions of evil. However, Kaiden drank from the chaos of war, growing stronger with evil. The Nuv, dwindling against the chaos, used the love power to seal himself and Kaiden away, concluding the great war. All right, so we got two different, well, we got Alliance and an Empire, uh, the Galanos Alliance, um, and six of, an alliance of six nations on the Eastern continent. They have distinct cultures, diverse values, and unchallenged freedom. Then we have the Holy Darkon Empire, a large unified state in the Western continent. They abide by the one law, protect order with unwavering faith. All right, so these guys all look pretty cool. I don't know which one looks cooler to me. I don't know. We're going to figure it out, though. Let me double check. I feel like I'm blind right now. We're going to go by looks. 
I'm gonna pick the red. All right, so we're going with that one. All right, let's see. What can we do? Oh, we can actually put more characters in? All right, so we can do a creative character. That's what we're going to do now. And I love playing range classes, guys. I have to play a ranger, I'm sure. But I have to see what other characters they have to offer. And then we can make our choice from there. All right, so Archer is what we have. All right, a forest of elf. A forest elf who draws upon the power of nature to unleash the relentless uh, barrage against her foes. She's got a couple skills here. Move this out of the way. That's piercing shot. See it again. It doesn't look like a piercing shot, but okay. Then we've got cyclone shot. That's kind of bad. I like it. Then there's going to be arctic shot. That's kind of cool. We've got attributes. We've got rejuvenate. Let's see. Uh, gradually restores the health of your party members. And then we have. I don't know what that one is. It won't let me only see it. That's okay, though. Let's check out the next hero, guys. This guy's tough, man. Look at this guy. It's like a barbarian type. Dual wielding axes. You can't beat that. Woo! All right, so we got the Titan. Desert Nomad who unleashes incredible raw strength to strike down enemies. We got Spinning Slash. Dang. We got Crush. And we have Boulder Drop. All right, so we got skull crack, stun and weaken nearby enemies. Eye gouge, disorient the west, uh, weakening or uh, weaken surrounding enemies. That's kind of cool. And we have a, I guess this is a healer maybe. Blade master. Wow. Looks like a bow, but it's not. Okay, so that's good there. And with this one, we got leaping mantis strike. That's kind of cool. Well, I already know I'm going to pick the, the the ranger or the archer. Winter stills the fox. And then we have rising dragon technique. That's pretty cool, man. Dang. All right, so I already know. I'm going with this range class for sure. Yep, going with the archer, guys. You can check out their outfits. That's cool. That's cool too. So cool in a weird way. We'll go with this one. If we can pick, I don't know. So we can pick the skin color. Wow. That's what's up. That's what's up. I like that. Can't leave the brown people behind, guys. We've got the eye color. I like to do like weird colors, man. I customize my stuff like a beast. Make her the green eye bandit. All right, so we can do the hair. Wow, that's a lot of stuff you could do. All right, so that's a cool hairstyle. The short one's kind of cool too. I always look at like archers, like you know, certain kind of hairstyles. That's kind of cool. All right, so we got hair color. Uh, I want an off the wall color. I like the brown hair. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right, so wait. Oh, they got the face you can change too. You got A, B, C. And D. All right, so this, this face is all right. So we're going to go with C. Let's go ahead and create that character there. All right, so let's see here. We're going to go with, put this away here. Let's go with that. Create. All right, so, all right, there we go. I'm about to say. Games hanging out by the wayside here. Like, what's the deal, bro? <clears throat> All right, so we got the login rewards, on time rewards, Titan, 
Blade Master, share your tips to increase attack. We have a lot of stuff. Alright, this place is the Alliance Trading Camp. You must check in here before departing Xanium. Alright, so we definitely want to get some training here, guys. We don't want them coming here shorthanded, so let's go. <clears throat> Alright, so tap in the map to view the mini map. Get this out of the way. Alright, you can use the mini map to view all kinds of information. Alright, tap the area you'd like to go on the mini map to move your character to that area. Nice! Mini map, quest icons pop where quests are available. Love it. This is a go, guys. So far, it's a go. It's graphically pretty good. I mean, I'm not going to say it's better than Lineage Revolution, but so far, it's all right. This is pretty new. It's fresh. All right, so let's check it out. So we already went on the mini-map and picked the spot that we wanted to go. And we can go faster. What? All right, Sergeant Instructor Saud. Seeker, your name is Swill, right? I heard you're pretty skilled on the battlefield. The soldiers have been talking about you. Thank goodness for Chef Boyardee. Why don't we begin immediately? Yes, let's go. All right, so we have... Where we have to go? Auto battle it? See, tar Sergeant Jabin. All right, so it actually runs to the thing for you. That's what's up. I like that. Because <clears throat> there's no way I'm going to be sitting there on a, on a phone running around like this. Not going to happen. All right, first, show me your battle stance. The basic attack is the foundation of all combat. Nice. All right, so my battle stance. All right, so it's attack, select target, and tap here by try or tapping the training dummy to attack. All right, training dummy, where are you, buddy? Nice. I'm not doing a lot about for this. I won't miss out. Alright, Alliance Training Camp. Nice. We get some rewards for it. And we level up to level 2. Piercing Shot, you learn a new skill. Okay. Alright, to use a uh, skill, select target and tap here. Tap here now to attack the training dummy. Battle training. All right, is this doing auto battle or what? Let me do my own attacks. Like what? What the what? Eliminate training dummy. Four out of five. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Basic attack skills, you passed. All right, so let me see. Galanos, this way leads out of the palace, Sika. Talk to Gatekeeper Conal. Conal! Let's see what this Jabroni has to do for us here. All right. All right, so this is, it's automatically going to auto battle, guys. I don't want that. So we have to eliminate some more. That's going to take away the fun. I don't play automatic. Not yet. Only when you're trying to grind and you're like, eh. But for this, is okay. And you don't have to really tap the screen. You just hold it down. And it shoots them automatically. All right, so we need to kill one more of these little rag nasty boars. Boar's head. You guys eat boar's head meat? If you like it, put those in the comments below. I love boar's head. What is this? I don't know what that is. It's probably some sort of teleport or something like that. So now we need to eliminate snake. And it goes back to automatic. I don't like that. That's a down. I don't want auto battle. Now run me to the mobs. That's fine. But I don't want automatic battle. That's pretty cool, though. I mean, honestly. 
But like once we get some more skills, which more skills are gonna unlock at level 10, or actually number seven, then 10, 12, 15, and then 20. And it looks like we have another weapon we can use as well. All right, so this is our last snake that we have to kill. All right, clearly you can hear yourself in the fight. Yes, I can. All right, so obtain herbs, five. Let's get it. I just can't, I guess I can't fight it. All right, so good work. This will be a huge boon for our Missinal Ward. All right, so eliminate Imperial Rangers times 10. Let's go. Run faster. I like that. But as far as like, is this game worth playing? Yeah, it's not too bad. It's not too rough. It's a little easy, but it looks like, you know, it's, it's more like a lineage revolution, which I don't want to replace that game, but that game is phenomenal. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and wrap this old tutorial up here, guys. Definitely want to thank everybody for watching. Like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace out, love y'all.